many times you will have a choice of choosing either regression model or tree based model so regression models could be linear regression logistic regression bayesian regression poisson regression and so on and tree based models like decision tree random forest uh, boosting bagging and so on the simplest form of uh, regression model is the linear regression we can see in this uh, you know graph and the simplest form of tree based model is a decision tree right now we will understand in this lecture as to when to go for regression model and when to go for a tree based model okay often there is this confusion that what is to be used when okay so a decision tree model looks like this it's a pretty much like a decision plot we start with a you know node you go to your sub nodes and that's how you classify so basically you uh, get create partitions in your uh, data and then take uh, either the uh, maximum count uh, the majority vote or the uh, or the mean of your data or the average of your data based on whether you are doing regression or a classification so those who are not familiar with the decision tree there is a video in this description section on decision tree and you can learn more about it so in equation form we can represent decision tree like this okay uh, a linear regression on the other hand is something that we optimize by fitting a straight line through your data uh, through the data points in such a way that uh, the uh, error is uh, minimum okay so we optimize uh, the uh, the error we optimize in such a way that the sum of the square of error is the minimum right so that's nothing but your least square regression and we represent that uh, using this right it's a function of your uh, beta parameters and that's how you build a model or fit a model to, uh, uh, to your data through regression lines so what are the differences now we have represented mathematically and graphically so what are the differences are so the question is which one is better so there is no correct answer to this so the only answer or the short answer to this question is it depends it depends on the situation that you are in okay so if the situation is that the relationship between target variable or the response variable and the features or the predictor variables is very clear okay and very easy to understand in such a scenario once you go in for the regression model okay because it is somewhat uh, easier to make regression model and it makes more sense in those scenarios but if the situation is slightly more complex and there exists uh, complex non-linear relationship and the linear regression models uh, may not be very suitable in such a case one should go for uh, decision tree or any other tree based model so here it's regression when relationship is more or less clear if relationship is not very clear and there seems to be some sort of a non-linear relationship then it's good, good to go with tree based models such as decision tree so that's the uh, thumb rule however one thing to keep in mind is that even when there there is clear relationship you can go ahead for decision tree even when there is non-linear relationship you can use regression model with non-linear form of regression model okay so there's nothing wrong in using but one of the first thing that should come in your mind are these two points okay and the way you actually choose one of this you know two options is by cross validations so build both the model and see which one is giving you uh, least error in the test data set okay so that's the way you choose uh, from one of this model a few differences between tree and regression model and there are of course pros and cons for using tree based model over regression model uh, tree based models are easy to explain because as you can as you have seen in the in the first slide you know there is a graphical representation of how the data has been you know segregated or uh, there is a partition of data so it's easy to explain to people it's easy to use in real world business because you can see how your uh, you know uh, variables are uh, how important are your variables the one that are very important will 
appear at the top of um, top of the tree so th those are to be given more importance so in real world business where you know non technical people will understand your model decision tree is easier for them it's easy to handle qualitative variable so you don't have to create dummy variable and use them in the model you instead can go ahead with uh, you know putting direct putting them directly in the model and it will be one of the um, sub segment of the tree so uh, that's something uh, easier to handle but there are some cons as well this seems to be performance issue with tree based model sometimes your tree based model cannot perform very well of course this can be overcome by using uh, you know bagging or boosting or random forest uh, um, so this uh, con or this demerit of the model first point can well be overcome by using more sophisticated tree based model which are you know ensemble models of different decision tree and there is a video on this in the description section on uh, bagging um, and random forest you can go through so how can you use multiple decision tree you know to you know overcome this issue you can increase your performance through this and the second uh, demerit of this is is non robust as in if you change the data if you change the data it's very sensitive it like a performance is likely to change quite a lot so it's not very robust in that sense so you never know if there is some change in future some change in your data in future it's likely to give a completely different results so that's another issue with tree based model however uh, the best way to select is to um, to sort of uh, see uh, whether whether what the intentions are if the intention is more of of you know explaining your um, both prediction as well as inference prediction as well as inference then better to go with regression based model but when it comes to uh, you know purely for prediction purpose and there exists non linear relationship good to go ahead with more sophisticated uh, tree based models such as random forest uh, or different type of boosting uh, tree based model okay